And now, are you familiar with the term sharenting? Uh, its official definition is the overuse of social media by parents to share content based on their, their little loved ones, their yeah. children. I'm sitting next to two I'm culprits right this. here. Yeah. I'm guilty of this. Uh, many now believe this new online trend has gone too far, with research showing that 45% of people think parents are simply showing off. Of course we are. <laughs> That's why we do it. <laughs> Letty Maciel runs the popular parenting blog, The Inside Edit. She's with us now. Um, What's wrong with it? It's great, isn't it? If you want to tell all your friends how uh, your l little kids have suddenly managed to ride the bike for the first time or have baked a cake for the first time, whatever, that's, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. I think, you know, we, we give birth and it's hard. And then you want to share, you know, what you've given to the world, essentially. And then you have this kid who's just learning to ride a bike, like you said, or maybe his first day at school, or learning to walk. Wait, wait, or... wait, wait, wait. That all sounds lovely. They're big milestones in a yeah. child's life. However, now I'm going to offend loads of my friends this morning. <laughs> uh, they'll unfriend me on Facebook. Um, but a lot of parents tend to um, share the downside of parenthood. So it'll be, I've been up all night with, you know, little Martha or whatever, or, you know, this just happened, or I forgot the packed lunch. It's every tiny bit of information about their children. It's the moaning that goes on as well. People aren't so in tune with that. I know, but sometimes you, could, you do need a good old moan. You need, you a, need, vent. You need a vent. You and need someone normal. to listen. Yeah, you need someone to just say, it's OK, hey, it's OK to forget the lunch. And it's OK not to have a fruit in that lunchbox. And, you know, you've got just crisps. So I've just got a pack of, mm. you know, like bread. Isn't, or... isn't it just, though, that parents become completely obsessed by their children? Their life no longer matters. It's all about the children and what you're doing for the children and where you're running around after the children. So when the children do something good, you've just got to put mm. it on every single social media. And it is showing off completely showing off but but that's fine parents are obsessed with children and that's fine yeah i think it's okay to be obsessed with your kids they're part of your life it comes you know with the whole parenting thing but you do need a little bit of a break and like with us at the inside edit we have you know one picture of our kids and then we have three of us talking about our experiences <laughs> so you have to ration it <laughs> yeah so people can see who we are as well that they understand us as parents and essentially understand our kids it's i think so i was just going to say the frustrating thing for me is when uh and we we, we, we know we, we know people who, who do this you know that they post pictures of their kids doing wonderful things, a lovely family walk, and then you speak to them later in the day and they say, oh, I've had a terrible day with the kids, you will not believe... And they're painting one picture on social media when the reality is quite different. And one person we know actually does paint, uh, does post pictures of their kids having tantrums in supermarkets. Yeah. And I think that's quite refreshing. Mm. Yeah, definitely. I think it's good. I mean, you'll have a moment where your kid is the most incredible and you think, I love you, you know, you've done an amazing thing today. And at that point, you capture it. And then the rest of the day is pretty bad. And then you, you want to capture that too to show both sides are really parenthood. There is a positive side to this because this survey did found that the, find that the most common reason for parents posting pictures of their children on social media is 82% said it's to connect with family, friends and members that they don't see very often. That's because true, yeah. that's a good point, isn't yeah. it? Because yeah. Jack, you've got family overseas in Brazil and presumably yeah. they don't get to see your children more than once a year. Well, if that, yeah. So mm. to connect with their grandma, they'll be on WhatsApp or they'll be on Facebook and she's obsessed because every picture you post she's sort of just lapping it up and yeah. made the more the better as far as as far as the grandma's concerned yeah. and that's that's just a good thing I think so I mean I have family in the Americas both north central and well all actually so every time I put a picture up and they really enjoy it they really want to see what the milestones have taken or you know what's happened today and just because they want to connect and a lot of my friends are using it as an online photo album because people don't have photo albums anymore do they so a lot no. of my friends are sort of cultivating their Instagram feed so it's a digital uh, photo album to just remind them. The problem is, of course, those embarrassing pictures of your kids you know, having <laughs> yeah. their first bath or... Privacy or settings, whatever. You know, when, when they're older, <laughs> that's all going to be over the internet, isn't it? Yeah, but people are going to be like, oh, you were so cute when you are taking your bath. It's not going to be that, oh, look at you, you know, you were take, you're having a bath at that age. <laughs> Everybody has a bath when they're a baby. It's just how you show it. And I think it's OK. I mean, it's, it's a normal part of life and... It's normal to have, like, my daughter, for example, she's nearly three, and she, she'll go on my Instagram page and she'll see, oh, look, mummy, I was cute, I was cute, you know? And I thought, yeah, she's three years old, but she can identify that as a six-month-old baby. Yeah, well, you cute. wait till she's 17. You'll <laughs> yeah. be posting those pictures. You'll get a phone call going, why did you Take put that, that up? Take that down <laughs> Well, there you go. I think the consensus is we don't mind a bit of sharenting here on Sky News Sunrise. No. We think yeah, it's, it's okay. Yeah, it's Everything in fine. moderation. Yeah. <laughs> Um, Jackie, what are you going to share with us about sport? Sharing 